You may be asked to find the greatest common factor for a set of numbers. To do this, you'll generate the factors for both numbers in the set, and then pick the largest number that appears in both lists. So for instance, for 16, our factors are 1, 2, 4, 8, and 16. It's because 1 times 16 is 16, 2 times 8 is 16, and 4 times 4 is 16. We can now do the same for 20. We have 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, and 20. So this is our entire list of factors. We look for the highest number both sets have in common, which in this case happens to be 4. So the greatest common factor for 16 and 20 is the number 4. Related to this, we also have least common multiples. To find the least common multiples, you generate multiples of each number in that set, and then pick the smallest number that appears in each. So for instance, we might be asked to find the least common multiple of 6 and 8. So rather than finding factors, we're finding multiples. So you just start doubling 6, 12, sorry, not doubling. You double for the first step, and then you add the number to itself. 18, 18 plus 6 is 24, 24 plus 6 is 30. And we can continue going if we need to, but let's do the other number. We have 8, 16, 24. And at this point, we know that our least common multiple for 6 and 8 is the number 24.